<coughs> Steve Evans is in Australia working with lawyers. <coughs> There's no justice here in New Zealand, he claims. The state is ruling. No faith in the state. <coughs> A civil war is brewing. Yes. <laughs> yes, it is. So? Yes. Exactly A what they civil want. war is brewing. Yes. They want civil unrest. <coughs> yes. And you're going to talk about Just bring out that list. Yeah, the list. Yeah, so when she uh, pre records oh, so prior to the show, you yeah. just say what Sorry, you want to talk yeah. about. Yeah. Yep. What's your name? Great. <laughs> yes. Mine's, my name's Jenny. Oh, Jenny. Okay. Yeah, I've been helping Jack for about three or four oh, years. Okay. <laughs> That's good. So I want to be in the yeah. middle of it too. Yeah. <laughs> I've come at the right time eh? because um, we're on to something. Really yeah. belongs to everybody. We'll also be talking about our protest, the rogue party's demand of public audit, boycott the rates of voting rights <coughs> in yeah. the country. Yeah. Yep. Where's, the, where's the money gone? Where's the money gone? Yeah. And PSA union protest recognising peer support, advocacy, those who support others. RAP, mm -hmm. Recovery Wellness Act Action Plan. Yeah. Using hope, personal responsibility, education, right. trust, and advocacy. So... Who's got the most talking time? No, no. Come over here, come over. No, who's got the most talking time? Because I'm just figuring out what who to put at what mic. No, he'll be alright. John's on that mic. Okay. And you share the mic with yep. the bro. The bro here. Okay. And he'll be custom big from Dino the calling out from, from the fringe. I can come over. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, okay. he, he generally comments from behind anyway. So yeah, we're pretty good at sharing. Yep. We work in together. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, I'll put on my mask. Like they're bringing more males into early childhood education. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Tom Phillips, uh, <coughs> one of the Popo man's stealing children. Did he actually rob a bank in um, Tikkawiti? The police suspect him of robbing a bank in Tikkawiti, yes. Right. And Oranga Tamariki, social concern. No funding for children anymore. Social service providers may go. And so I see the text of Steve Evans and saying that's a win for us. Yeah. And eventually, as I said, John was telling me, pension, gone. Is he okay? They're going to cut the pension. Did yeah. he lie to me or did he actually lie? Who? Steve Evans. Yeah, well, he's in Australia at the moment. Oh, good. I hope he's well. We made up. Okay, get your phone going. You've got another three minutes and we'll go on. I got my rap here. Down with the black and white rabbit fence. Indigenous rights come together to think. Freedom, justice, equality for all. Common men unite. He the call. By cultural e a a My little boy, um, so I'll... She's not listening to this. I'll get my, <laughs> my babies in the car. Yes. Oh. With um, Nana and Beyonce. Bring them in. Oh, um, if he starts to, because he's asleep, so if he starts crying, I say, right. bring them in. Yeah, bring them in. Yeah. yeah. Show him on the stage. I just want to be like, yeah. Get them sitting out here. Because he might say something. No, it doesn't matter. Where are they? <laughs> you should have brought them. Jenny, you should have brought them in and told them to sit out he's here. He's asleep yeah. and I want to step in. Yeah. He's having it's a, a bit impersonal. I mean, they should be. He's having a nap. I'll bring him on <coughs> camera. After the thing. Yeah, okay. Yeah. <coughs> Te Te Kotei o tanga. How do you pronounce that, John? Te Kotei Tanga. Te Kotei Tanga. Te Kotei Tanga. Who in your green boy called it Yeah. Mm -hmm. The Crown Judiciary Council. <coughs> You look so good, sweetie. Have you been The jester stole his crown. The king was in the moon. <laughs> Damn. I'll tell you, I won't even tell you when we're filming. Yeah, no, just so long as we go on, just after. The courtroom was adjourned. No verdict was returned. That's right. <laughs> oh, gosh, I just look so tragic, eh? I look so sick. Now, it's what's on the inside, Jenny. It's in your heart. What's in your heart? I'm not interested in externals. <laughs> no, but I mean... How's your nose? I'm a girl. 
waiting, still waiting for the flip and nose job. Oh. <laughs> my son broke my nose like four times. Now, this podcast that we need to discuss where that can be downloaded from, too. Yeah, well, you need to discuss that with Danny. Yeah. Because she's the one who knows about it. Okay. The family court's given my little boy... Oh, hurry up. I forgot my um, constitutional marshals badge. You haven't got one on you, have you? The family court's given my little boy separation anxiety. Oh. From me. Why? Oh, because he's been separated from mummy for too long, and now he's back, yeah. and he doesn't. He thinks I'm gonna go, right? Because we've finally got him back. Ah, yeah. Shared parenting, just work it out somehow. But I should be grateful. I mean, it's okay. So the court's put been us pretty good for me. Put us on, Jenny. Yeah, I'm waiting. Yep. I'm waiting. Oh wait, here we go. Can you people stop? Sending me fucking notifications. Fuck's sake. Oh, fuck off my heart radio. <laughs> Mine's a TV. I know. <laughs> the wiggles on I heart radio, though. <laughs> okay. Now, hold on. I've got the camera on me. Are we on? Now we're officially loading. Three, two, one. Okay, my friendship's back. Hello. Hi, how's it going? Um, I just wanted to take this opportunity to apologize for the poor internet connection. But hey, I don't pay for it. So it's on, all good. is it happening? Yeah, yeah, we're here. Hey guys, um, so today is our show from the fringes, and there's one, two, three, four, five people in a studio. Yep, so we need our own kaitiaki army, home guard, training, <coughs> sovereigns, and uh, self determined individuals. New Zealand is a violent country, there should be consequences of ram raiding and hammer, hammers used and stealing. The government crackdown on the crime police have been um, stepped up on the beat. They're going to put police on the beat. So we know that this is a band aid. The real problem is with families. There's no love with children, no respect or discipline. It all starts in the home. Also, um, Steve Evans from Australia uh, has been working with lawyers. He trained as no justice in New Zealand. The state rules, no faith in the police. A civil war is brewing. And we've got John Wanoa. Okay, here today. John will be talking to us about who we really are as sovereigns in this nation, the sovereignty of the chieftainship. And you may be wondering why I'm wearing this crown. Yeah, Crown Judicial Council. Okay, that's why I'm wearing it, because... You look good, baby. The People's Court in Huntley will have a home guard and a resting group, a, a posse, which will be going out and putting claims on people who... Serving documents. Serving documents on people. Okay. Individuals will earn their crowns growing from infants or idiots, gaining their independence from corporations, identifying with the Royal Crown Council. Mm-hmm. Okay, because uh-huh. we all know the birth certificate is a bit of a con. The passport has a child's ID photo on it, and it's split in half for a million dollars in gold currency on it. Apparently, five hundred thousand goes to pay if you get into a criminal activity. What about the other five hundred thousand? Don't know a lot about that. In terms of the equation, yeah. Dean's here today, guys. Yep. And so, what are you going to be talking about today? Oh. Um, just going to bring up a bit about the Bible, Jack, and talk about fools for Christ and foolishness. I did a Google search, I thought about that, and I'll read out some 
global movement. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And our free counselling line for lost boys, men blind, 0508435727. Helen and the Funny Girls must go. Helen Clark supporting um, the, another pandemic. Yep. She was on TV this Why day. is she supporting jab? Yeah. <coughs> Jabbing. Yeah. She used to be a, a and uh, The courage. Auntie, like, I loved Helen. I yeah. think maybe half of the country loved Helen. Don't talk what to do our reckon? leader about that. What do you reckon? Does half of the country love Helen Clark? Mm. Oh, she didn't get as many death threats as Jacinda, I suppose. Yeah, I don't even know why the death threats <laughs> were so high with Jab Cinda. Yeah, Because yeah. of COVID. Yeah, but like she only did like one thing wrong. Well. Mm. Oh, we're almost on. The there. mindset Sorry. out there. We've got to moan about something. Guys, I just want to tell you, I'm a bit sick today. The courage to be a man. More males in early childhood education. Marakopa man stealing children. Yeah, good morning. This is From the Fringes, a program about alternative provocative views. My name is Jack Geelan. We're Vox Populi, Vox Deo, the voice of the people. Now, Prince William is doing the daddy dance uh, with Taylor Swift. He's moving like this. Wait uh, a minute, can you expand? What, on the daddy dance? Yes. You know, dads, Prince William. What? What are you talking <laughs> about? Yeah, well, they had one of her concerts. Concerts, yeah. The Julian, dance. Yep, Julian Assange is a hero of free speech because he's being set free. Do yeah. you know what? I always thought he was really cool. Yeah. Uh, he, he had a child in captivity, didn't he? Yeah, he's a wonderful character, a character. And we support free speech, but these are our own opinions. And Helen Clark is supporting the idea of the next uh, pandemic. Do you really want to vote for her again? Oh, mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So we need our own kaitiaki army, home guard, and we need to train sovereigns and self-determined individuals. And we have John Wanoa. Wanoa here to talk about that today. New Zealand is a violent country. There should be consequences for ram raiding, and they're using hammers when they steal or break into shops now. With government crackdown on crime, reintroducing of military training boot camps police on the beat i'd like to see the the police on the beat you know talking to people what kind of beat well you know walking the streets okay in our city. well as long as that doesn't entail brutality yeah but controversy i'm happy the real issue is on cops jack they did it in america it works you get less police crime body yeah. cam well if you ask the policeman yeah the right questions, yeah. Then you will establish: is he acting lawfully, or is he acting legally? Now we know with all the crime that's going on, it goes back to childhood. How the child is being raised. If there's no love, no respect, no discipline, the children will get out of control, won't they? Yes. That's right. Mm. Now Steve Evans is in Australia, working with lawyers, as there's no justice in New Zealand. He claims. The state rules with no faith in the police. A civil war is brewing. Steve believes in shared parenting. So um, this idea of a civil war, John, what, what do you think when the, the sovereignty of the people is taken away and uh, they don't recognise the, the sovereignty of the chieftainship anymore? Do you think there's going to be an uprising from the people where they don't recognise treaty rights of that Matariki? last week and talking to a Maori person there and he was saying there's no equality with the treaty the Maoris feel they're on the bottom so what do you think needs to happen John? Okay <clears throat> first of all I'll introduce myself as John Wanoa from East Cape so yep. that's Ngāti Pro area and I'm up in uh, Ngāpui been there for years for sorting and solving the problem of yep. Maori 
and uh, and the rest of New Zealand who's who who's got the title to the land, the yep. native land, yep. and I'm here for the native land title yep. to Britain direct. Yep. And the government of Wellington is the little crown, yep. and you've got your crown which is in the right place on your head, yep. as you are the crown now, because the British crown has abandoned us, yep. abandoned all the native countries, oh. and gone into Germany, Frankfurt, with all the stolen gold, and all the stolen money and your birth certificate are gone there. That's where I'm at. Mm. <coughs> and who is running that? Carl Schwab is the leader of the World Economic Forum oh, we that's can. leading the pandemic. Yeah. <coughs> and he's ran away now. They're all running away with like Jacinda Dern, do the damage yep. and run. Right. Because they know. Hey, hey, can I just mm -hmm. take a minute to Asking say? Asking anything. Matua. <laughs> yeah. Yaura. Yeah. So with the royal it. royal crown council, <coughs> yeah. there's a false crown, yep. and there's a true crown. Yes, that's yeah. correct. I'm and here. and yeah. the people's court um, in Hutley will have a home guard <coughs> and a resting group of people, like they'll, they'll act like a posse, will be set up with the ordinances of the court, also involving land title, non-residential citizens. Individuals will earn their crowns, growing from infants and idiots, gain, gaining their independence from the corporations, identifying with the Royal Crown Council, Judiciary and Common Law as Constitutional Marshals. Where's your sheriff badge today, Dean? Uh, well, I left it behind. Yeah, yeah we, we are Constitutional Marshals. We yes. stand for the rights of the people and the Royal Crown Council. The birth certificate and passport has an ID photo on it, but it's split in half with a million dollars in gold currency given to each child. Half a million goes if you get involved in crime, and the other half a million dollar is what's your worth in security bonds. That's is that right, right Dean? Bond generate. That's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah so generate. this involves admiralty law, you know, uh, the passport being in dock and this sort of thing. Yes. So there's a false understanding mm. with Admiralty law, yes. which honours the Crown, yes. but not the people, yes. not people's rights, yes. not constitutional marshals. Yes. So, um, yeah, Bay Corp challenged through cease and desist notices, rates demand uh, by Andrew Hudson, I think his name is, has no jurisdiction as serving a corporation. The council is borrowing from an overseas uh, corporation. Corporations dictate to us bestowing personhood in nautical terms, in dock, passport, uh, seaway roads. Yeah. So this is a huge problem because yeah. people feel they have to pay the rates. But who, where the, where's the money going to? Dean, where's the money going? It goes to the International Monetary Fund. It goes to the International Monetary Fund. And paying off a debt they have created, because apparently with paper money, you can create more money for yourself. That's right. And it becomes fraudulent, it's doesn't it? It's called fractional reserve banking. It's called fractional reserve, reserve banking. banking. Yeah. So we have a protest that's happening tomorrow. You all invited you, Jenny and Jeff down outside the, the council, stop Hamilton Council, council's planned rates increases. Join Ooh. the protest. Can I bring Kenny Papa? Yes, you can be Kenny Sweet, Papa along. The rate payers are pay demanding <laughs> a public audit. Boycott the rate, rates. A vote of no confidence in the council. Would Jesus drive out the money changers from the temple? Yes, most definitely. So, what do you think of all this, John? I think it's you're right on the button. Yeah. You're right on the money because that's where I'm at. The corporate's money, and they're turning into bitcoins and crypto now. They make yeah. the politicians. If you look, Chris Luxton is leading it off with four hundred dollars to buy into their crypto new ah. digital money, and I'm on that. I'm so chasing is that real up. money? Is that real gold currency? Is He's that using the people's that's, money to that's, go and enrich himself. Yeah. That's to replace the feared fake money. Yeah. They're yeah. going on to another fake money and they're going to snap all the crypto and demolish them. That's what I'm following so right now. When you put a bowl of lollies in front of kindergarten children, Jake, the New Zealand government's lost.
stock been estimated four hundred billion dollars on the international stock market in yeah. the last thirty years alone. Yeah. Right. That's why OCC doesn't pay out. That's why the the retirement fund went broke at one stage. There was nothing in it. Yeah. Because now, Ke Kerry Bevan, he's our leader of the Republic of New Zealand Party. Apparently, he's got a couple of broken <coughs> ribs, unfortunately. But he used to talk about the inner warrior. Men's Retreat presents the courage to be a man. Pink-tinged, pussy-whipped, androgynous apologies for men. Oh, <laughs> honey, I don't think you That's can... That's a bit extreme. I don't it? think you can say that on air, but I guess it's true to life. Yeah, That's well, there's real men, isn't there? Like, you know, uh, standing up for a man, to, uh, the courage to be a man. Yeah. The art of being a warrior is the only way to balance the terror of being a man with the wonder of being a man. <laughs> so, you know, we challenge men in our society. Men are being charged for everything, aren't they, basically? And, and we do uh, it in a peaceful manner. But this morning on the AM show, they talked about more males in early childhood Education, you don't see many males in schools now there being teachers. eight New Zealand male midwives as of 2017. Is I there? Believe. Yes. And <laughs> Maracopa man at steals children because he's hiding out. He's gone off the grid, apparently. Mm. Um, what's his name? Oh, the, the man who abducted... Phyllis. His own three children. His, his own three children, Phyllis. yeah. Because he wasn't given custody. With shared parenting, we know that both mum and dad have input into the up. But if you're going to steal the child off the father, there's, there's a, going to be consequences. There's a few arguments about this, yes. okay? And one of the theories... I don't mind arguments. From one of the time. theories is, is that the <laughs> courts and judges recognise that the mother has a stronger maternal bond, especially for the first five years. Yeah, but you can't deny the father, Jim. I know. A child needs a father. My son needs me as a dad. A lot of dads have been if written off. If we want to go into, excluded. do I believe that the uh, family court system is just? Yeah. That's a whole different conversation. Yeah. yeah. But I do, I do worry about men's mental health yeah. when they are going through the FC. So a mature man is an inner warrior. He realises that the major battles in his life will be fought and resolved within himself. A mature man is someone who has the courage to know himself. So men need to know themselves. We need the warriors to step forward. Forward. If we're going to have the kaitiaki guardians in our own home guard, we need to train men to be men, don't we? Yes. In our uh, society. Mm -hmm. And another factor relating to children is oranga tamariki, social concern, no funding for children. No, they're cutting back on social service providers with Oranga Tamariki, and they're not going to get the funding anymore. Well, so we have protested against Oranga Tamariki, haven't we? I've I've had one encounter with a social worker. Yeah. Um, and I don't know that she was any less scared than the rest of the staff I've ever met from Oranga Tamariki. Yeah. She seems scared, and she seems scared of the hierarchy. Yeah. I don't know. This is a personal opinion. Yeah, well, it's Families for Justice. We've protested about their trafficking in children and not being there for children and this sort of thing, and they've been mm -hmm. held accountable. You know that, don't you? Yeah. Many a time we're with Steve Evans. And I personally, I'm not condoning all the injustice that has happened from OT. Yeah. But I personally have not had a bad encounter with an OT social worker. You haven't? No. There's quite a few people have. Yeah, I'm, I'm blessed though. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. Because I've heard a lot. Now the RSA is closing down as they are in debt. Older veterans are dying. They're joining the Workermen's Club here in Hamilton. Uh, so there's going to be a subsection of the RSA, the terms servicemen's association so are they closing down around new zealand the rsa you know what i mean we need, need to honor the vets in our freedoms and our democracies within our society so there's major changes going on there and also we've got another psa protest the psa union protest which is happening on the first of july uh, 10 ross trevor street Recognising peer support advocacy, those who support others. Now, RAP, 
is recognizing wellness action plan using hope, personal responsibility, education. What do you think of peer support, Jenny? It's kind of crucial to anything community. So what do you think of the government cutting back funds to peer support advocacy and recovery? Well, that's just, I know where David Seymour lives. Yeah. Oh, that, you know. Are you going to protest outside his house <laughs> over this? Heard. He's taking hey, away the rights of the people, I mean, wellness and health. You're the activist here. I don't know if I'm the activist. Yeah, but you're going to become a wahini who's, who's a, Mana wahine. a warrior, aren't you? You're going to stand up and fight, aren't you, in this battle for your rights? I don't the know if, or? if the strategy of screaming outside Seymour's house is going <laughs> to change anything. I think you need to be more strategic. Yeah? Yeah. But we do need to realise that we need our own kaikiaki army, our own home guard. We need to train sovereigns who are self-determined. Now, John, mm -hmm. you know when you talk about self-determination yeah. and uh, kawanatanga, yeah. the right to self-government, yeah. what do you think of that? That's embodied in the treaty. Now, they're saying that the Maori people ceded their sovereignty. What do yep. you think? Well... The Ngāpui, I spent all my life up there, um, yes. from the East Coast, and I've learned everything about how they think with the most powerful corporation flag in the world. Yeah. The Whakaputanga is what they call it. We call it, in Britain, the Confederation of the United Tribes. That's yeah. the difference between the two. One is native, the Confederation, and the other is Whakaputanga, Maori. The right. word Maori was created by the Pākehās in the government in Wellington. It's not real. Everything is like Warren Buffett says. Yes. It's a practice or a, a fake crown. Or a, a fake, fake crown. Yeah, a yeah. fake crown. Or the jester stole his crown. <laughs> the yeah. king wasn't amused. It's to please, it's to yeah. please the politically correct. Yeah, so yeah. Warren Buffett and Manga. The two um, uh, old hands yeah. are saying the 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 um, crown and its money is is a artificial goal. Ah, artificial, yeah. fraudulent, artificial it's goal. It's fake money. Yeah, it's right. fake money. Well, we're and being all controlled by fake money. These yeah. are our own opinions. <laughs> the, so, of the Federal Reserve, haven't yeah, the Federal so Reserve. So, when you talk about uh, the heart chakra, yeah, you know. Aroha Nui. Yeah. And when you talk about peer support advocacy. Yeah. And even the the Theosophical Society. Yeah. Free access to spirituality. Yeah. Now the headquarters up in Auckland is stealing our lodge. Yeah. It's yes. all about money oh grubbers. My gosh. Yeah. And Freemasonry. Yes, oh that's where I'm at. Yeah. I'm right in the middle of this. This is blooming evil. Yeah. This is going society. on. The RSA is shutting down. That the Theosophical Society is, is stealing our lodge in Hamilton. We need to congregate outside David Seymour's house. That is why. We need to challenge these politicians. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Take these nice so that's, that's what I'm here for, to put the puzzle together with you guys, the realists. Ah, you, you are the real thank you. We're part realists. of the we're, we're puzzle. Truthers. You are the puzzle that yeah. completes their story. It is your story, not their his story. Yeah. Right. Now, uh, Jeff, I'll bring you in in a minute, but Matariki celebrates the midwinter Christmas, the shortest day of the year, uh, where we talk about multiple food source harvest and pahutakawa, you know, that's where you commit your dead loved ones, you know, that's a star up there at, uh, in the north. Uh, the bear chief cult and the golden dove. Can you bind the chains of the Pleiades, the arm of our galaxy? Did you know that Mazaroff, all the constellations go uh, right around the Orion? That's the where Pleiades. I'm at with the Moai statue on East Island. Yes. That's my whakapapa. That's there, your whakapapa? Right there with the Queen took the Moai statue to England yes. and she's using it for her title on her lands all over the world. So we're called to ride the chariot throne with God and identify with the lion eagle star roar. Can I have the lion eagle star roar? Come on, Jenny, you're a woman, you can give it. Roar. You're <laughs> roar. Eagle throne. Roar. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. It's painful. So Matariki symbolizes the Benjamin Shepherd King Priest Company. There we've got the King Priest. Yeah, the jester stole his crown. That's good, darling. Now, I went to a Matariki celebration, and one Maori guy says, there's no equality, we are at the bottom. 
The corporate Hories, they believe in the trickle up. It, that's what Winston Peters said. He said some of the Maoris that stand for parliament and that, they're going for all the money. But yeah. are they really concerned about their people? Can you tell me that, John? Yeah, sure, I'll tell you. There's no. two types of Maori, those yes. in parliament and those outside parliament. Yes. The ones in parliament are the ones that are in partnership yeah. with the Pākehās in the parliament. Yeah. And they are the ones that are using the new company, used to be called Queen and Right of New Zealand. Queen and they Right of New Zealand. It in it's the sea, and yeah. they've got a new one called Crown Sovereign of New Zealand. Now, now, I've seen the latest uh, political polls say that um, National's gone up, you know, along with David Seymour, the three Scrooges. Do you think they've gone up in their ratings? I think they may have given <laughs> a media source more money. May have. Yeah. <laughs> now, I don't know if their popularity has. Now, Jeff, you had some <laughs> spiritual stuff to share with us, didn't well, you? Well, I was actually just going to read out some Bible verse that we yes. lead back a little minute. I did a Google search. I yep. looked up 9 11 inside job, and the first thing on top was anti Semitic conspiracies about 9 11 in jail 20 years later. Yeah. The October 7th attacks on the illegal state of Israel. Apparently, Mossad, Mossad, the secret intelligence group. Yeah, alle involved, allegedly, yeah. 1,131 people died, 764 civilians, yes. 173 security personnel, and there were 251 hostages. To date, so far, 660 Israeli troops have been killed. I've seen, haven't seen one single image of and or Was that an inside job by, by the uh, Zionists? In my opinion, I've yet to find the evidence to prove it, but there's evidence that proves Neil Armstrong didn't walk on the moon. All you do is look it up. Don't but men of experts. faith are the sons of Abraham. So there's a wonderful side to Israel. Being Thou Joseph shalt Egypt. not murder, Jack. Yeah, yeah. We know that, but there's two sides to this equation because Netanyahu is conscripting ultra-Orthodox men, rabbis. Now, they wouldn't want to participate in that battle, would they? Well, as one of his lead um, murderers resigned last week. His name is Benjamin as well. So you've got them dropping away on one side and actually he's going to scratch like turkey. Because I don't believe in those crimes against humanity. And Have you ever heard of a drowning else. rat grasping at straws? Why can't they yeah. use, use Aro Hanui in love you and, and understand in God, true right? justice? Yep. You and I believe in God, right? Yes, we do. Um, yeah. Wrong bloodline. Yes. Um, Even Dean, Dean believes in the so Lord Jesus Christ. Doesn't that mean that the world's going to end so we don't actually have to worry? Yeah, but we're not waiting for Jesus to come on a cloud, Jenny. We've got to get real. When the we, Bible, we have to be we the change as king priests. That's you, why I'm wearing this crown. Yeah, yes, you know what I mean? yes, we are the true crown. Come yes, on. Yes, through the Lord's of pain, through the, the change that you should be. the end of these world governments and a new government yes. that comes into place. It's the government the of the Lord Jesus world. Christ. What? It's yes. the end of these conspiracies. This is what we're, we're yes. establishing that here today. We're training up the Kaitiaki army. Yeah. We're training up the king priests. We're training up those who know the rights in the Lord Jesus Christ. We're training up crown judicial people who are going to know their rights, not the fools, not the idiots who don't know that they are sovereigns. And how many of them are there out there? 99 out of 100. That's right. <laughs> Matthew's yeah. It's great time for them to be educated. The great Matthew's to put on a judicial yeah. crown. You know? And when thou prayest, thou shalt not be as the hypocrites are, for they love to pray standing in the synagogues and in the corners yeah. of the street that they may be seen of men. Verily I say unto you, they have their reward. Yeah, yeah so you're talking about the synagogue of Satan. You're well, talking about what Jesus said, they were of their nine. father, the devil. Revelation so, 3, 9, Jack. Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, right. which say they are Jews and are not, but do lie. Behind so them. you're saying that could be false Jury, they the money men behind the Jews. scenes, using upside down Just because some guy puts on a funny little hat and bangs his head against a brick wall, it doesn't make him a Jew, Jack. That hey. includes the media who are PC. I've been called a rabbi before, you know, in the Lord Jesus, my heavenly Father. James 5 1. Go to now, ye rich men, weep in hell for your miseries that shall come upon you. Okay, down with the black and white rabbit face. Indigenous rights come to their defense. Freedom, justice, equality for all. Common men unite, heed the call. By cultural liaison officers, universal diplomat ambassadors, peacekeeping activists, freedom fighters, kawanatanga, tekotei tanga, 
Happy Iwanuku Rainbow Kodawa. Yeah, so I'm calling on all the common people. I'm calling on all the Maori people. I'm calling on all people of New Zealand to claim the real crown, not yes. the false crown. Yes. Know yourself as Koiti, the Koitiaki Army. Know yourself as a person endowed with rights by your creator. What do you want to say about this? Self-education. Empower yourself with the knowledge Empower to fight yourself. the system. That's right. And we have the People's Court in Huntley. We'll have a home guard and arresting group, a posse. Because you know, when you stole someone's cattle, what happened to you over in America? Sometimes you were hung. Well, on that course. Yeah, but, but there's one point there. <laughs> With the hanging, do you realise that that was their food supply? And if someone stole a cow, they'd be st uh, stealing half the farmer's money and revenue. A child it? in England 200 years ago for stealing an apple would be shipped to Australia. What? Yep. Yeah, well, I mean, that's why they had the French Revolution. The peasants are revolting and someone yeah. will lose their heads, you know. And so, on that note, the cattle note, Jack, the planet needs to halve the herd. Yeah. In the next 10 years, we need to get rid of half the cattle. All these farmers, dairy farmers out there, speak to your friends about the diversification because plant hair is going belly up as a direct result of the need yeah, but that, for the th planet. They're saying the save the cows from being exported on boats. Save the dogs, but what about saving the men? <laughs> Wait a minute. What Wait about saving our family? People still drink <laughs> dairy. Yeah, that's People right. People still no. eat cheese. Yeah, but oh, they're going like to produce hybrid meat. Of the world cares about it now. I think I think the government's giving a bit more money to the farmers, though. You know, no. they need no, to really reforest. You know, to stop all the water going. Not into to like, not to be horrible about like a skill set or anything, storm. but yep. that it's it is needed, but it's not. Needed. And a new um, global government, Jack's going to bring in a, a global footprint tax. Rather that's than right. And export yeah, but uh, be uh, I'm money. suspicious of 666, the number of the beast, brother. <coughs> I, I only believe in the reign of Christ. I only <coughs> believe in the king priest crowning and yeah. revelation. Knowing who we are in the Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. What do you think, John? Yeah, I think you're on the button. Kapai me te atua. Yeah, you are. Because I used to belong to Alex Phillips many years ago yep. at Manu Ariki, Ariki yeah. and he gathered all the tribes of the world. He had yeah. uh, Aborigines, yep. he had American tribes, yep. and he was promoting uh, the Madonna movement. You know, when you identify and solarize mm, yep. with the lower tones, you can you can actually see the Donna. Madonna. She brought forth a male child who's a ruler of the nations with a rod of iron. And we are part of God's army in these last days. So, But individuals will earn their crowns growing from infants or idiots, gaining their independence from corporations, identifying with the Royal Crown Council, judiciary and common law as constitutional marshals. We need more marshal badges. We need to recruit more people into this Kaitiaki army. And this uh, Monday, Jenny, you're coming along. They're having the Hamilton West meeting at one o'clock. I so. think I've got custody that day. I need more support. I, know, huh? I need more of your <laughs> men to come along. Okay, wait, Simon no, I there. don't. I just checked my archive. Yeah. And my brain's still cool. Yeah. Yeah. And Bay, <laughs> Bay Corp is being challenged through cease and desist notices. Rates demand by Andrew <laughs> Hudson. Uh, they, these rates demands are claiming they've got no jurisdiction as they're serving an overseas corporation. Corporations dictate to us bestowing personhood in nautical terms in dock, being in dock, the passport, uh, road seaways. What do you know about this, Dean? Maritime Admiralty Law. The Maritime Admiralty Law. Okay, and so New Zealand is a uh, violent country. Uh, there should be consequences with ram raiding and hammers used and with the government crackdown on crime. This is going on. They're reintroducing of military training boot camps and the police on the beats, the old Bobby on the beat. I'd like to see a lot more of that. Wouldn't Bandage you? over the problem. Yeah, but will they bring in martial law and will the, the black water come in and take total control and you won't be able to talk to the policeman? We don't, we don't I saw a policeman yesterday outside Margaret's house. I said, hello, how are you? And he said, we're not here for you, Mr. Gillen. We're here. We're just talking to someone on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> Did they think that you thought that... They were there, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, we have to wisen up and we need to 
honor our the king priest the lord jesus christ and we have to bring in the reign of christ which is so very important and don't forget to come along tomorrow to the rakes um pay as demand the public audit outside the council that will be happening at 11 o'clock tomorrow yep. and also on the 1st of july do come along to the union protest recognizing peer support advocacy we're against peer supported society we believe in free access to spirituality and not them stealing our lives okay from the fringes for another week say goodbye john wonderful okay thank right you here. very much anytime thank i'll be back again yeah we'll have um, you back again yeah. in and a week or Spanish, two La Pante, yeah. este give me the word the sovereignty of the chief peace be with you god bless you all see you later have a fantastic week <coughs> there we go Now you've got a good heart, Jenny. I'm sick. She had parenting with your Yeah. Band. I found okay. out you know my heart condition. Yeah. I found out that it actually is Yeah. Be like healed in the name of Jesus. Like two you stand days against ago. all those conditions. You and can be healed. My partner wasn't telling me because he didn't want me to. You pray in tongues? <laughs> yes I do. Get grub come on, shab up. Jack, if God wants you dead, he wants you dead. Yeah, no, no. I want you alive. You don't want to be dead. I'm still breathing. So he obviously wants me here. Don't forget peer support advocacy. Thank you for coming along, mate, and having your say. Yeah, thank you very much. I'll be back again. We need more. I've got instruments. We have suicide to be discussed with the Dr. Peter Stone for another three years, so that's good. Right. I hope you guys. I hope you guys have. Don't forget. Rainbow ribbons. Zip it. Okay, sorry. Z zip it. <laughs> You're a partly French, huh? Do you do one walking? Do you okay. Okay. I don't see you walking. <laughs> <laughs> um, I hope you guys have a fantastic week. Um, you can catch this on iHeartRadio. Yep. Um, under the stones crowd. Spotify, um, iTunes. Send it off to your friends. Do that. Friends or the video. Um, and I got yeah, banned from saying this, up, but thank nah, you, don't worry New Zealand on here. Stand up, come on. <laughs> ah, what are you doing? Have you even pressed upload? I'll give you one of these. Oh, oh yeah, thanks. Practicing and proclaiming yeah. the truth. Let's talk to them and say hello. Yeah. Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. I don't Take this over and read it. Buddy Night Gera, Buddy Night Gera, he's a, like a Kiwi Six. comedian. Oh, yeah. He was watching. That was good. Oh, you know what? There's no Marys on Star Trek. Why? He's a funny guy. <laughs> he's, a, he's a 100 funny guy. Why did they pick Jesus out of the tub? Why? To get turning water into wine. For those of you who haven't figured out the gods, Wisdom in the Bible, actually, because it's all parables. First Corinthians one twenty eight. But God hath chosen the foolish things of the world to confound the wise, and God hath chosen the weak things of the world to confound the things which are not, and base things of the world, and things which are despised. We'll go out here and we'll have a quick cup of coffee. Not yes, I'll come back. I'll just take yep. my baby and my yep. mum. Good. Recognise the parables. Thank you, Jenny. Go to Mark 4.11. I think this Jesus is a mistake, said, leaving him with the lie. <laughs> Unto you <laughs> have been given to know the mystery of God's kingdom. <laughs> but to those so, who uh, are... We're back. team players. We're not individuals. All this these things were done in parables. A team. Think about it. Army. All parables. That's thank you very much, John. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Uh, yeah. 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 That was good. Thank They're you. Terrible. Arming people with knowledge. Peace yeah. be with you. Is in totally in no Yep. Because the more people are educated yep. about what's really going on, the faster. Hopefully, it. we'll probably have about 300 people viewing that this week, so that's good, John. Yeah. The message is going to go around New Zealand. Yeah, that's the one. You don't mind being online? No, nope, I don't mind being anywhere here. Yep. Yep, with you and Nephi. Good. And Jenny. Oh, it's right on. It's right on time. Revelation 13, 18, Jack. Here is wisdom. We'll catch you later. And that's the 89 the FM, free FM, Hamilton, New Zealand. And, his number and is now I can go to the protest tomorrow at the council office with uh, Jack Elling and uh, um, Dean Murray with all these um, experts.
experience and documents that goes along with our native court. Okay, so see you later. And enjoy your day today. It's Tuesday, the 26th, I think it is, of June 2024. See you later. Bye. The symbol is Native. Yeah, it's yeah, like doing natural sense. The more you begin to investigate, the more you see lies. Well, what if it's the Theosophical Society in Auckland yeah, yeah, stealing yeah. our lives? Yeah, yeah. Freemasonry. Yeah. Kill it. Theosophical Society. Yeah. See you later. Bye. It's all about the money and power. Or if you like that, James 5 1, go to now, you rich men. Weep in hell for your misery that shall come upon you. Well, this guy's a preacher. Yeah. He's a king priest. He, he knows the rights of the Lord Jesus. Ah. Say goodbye to all the people. Bye bye. Jesus loves you all. <laughs> We're all king priests. <laughs> hey, I don't know how to do that. I'm just trying to stop it. There you go. You need a large broadcast. I hope it's Jenny doesn't mind. Hold on. I'm mm. trying to stop mine. It's still going. Should be still on that if they shut down. Hey, watch out, watch out, watch out. I'm trying to stop it. Oh, yeah. It's still going, bro. Yeah, it's still recording. Mm, I'm trying to stop it here. Push the uh, pause button. That oh. one. Danny. No, not perfect. It's not working. I just shut the thing down. I just... What does that do? No. It usually stops when I press it. Yeah. No, it's changed up. Yeah. Yep, go make it.